Good morning, Ingles. Welcome to WESH on this Tuesday morning. Let's go over to Ava Pizzuti with our pledge and character pledge. Good morning, Ingles. Let's stand for our pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Now let's move over to Cancun, Mexico, where David is standing by with our lunch menu. Good morning, Eagles. And today's lunch will have chicken fajitas, Mexican corn, and a sort of fruit. Have a great lunch, Eagles. That does sound like a fiesta in the cafeteria, David. A few days ago, I got to speak to our new principal, Mrs. Buck. Let's take a look. So I am here to interview our new principal, Mrs. Buck. So would it be okay if I asked you a few questions? Absolutely. So what do you like about your new job here at Eighth Street? Well, I think um, the best thing is that I get to learn a new school. I get to learn new students and new families. Um, and I really have become a part of the family, and that's, that's an awesome feeling to have, that it's not just a job, um, that it truly is something that I love and care about and look forward to come into in the morning. So I think that's probably one of the best things that I love about my job. Well, we love having you here, too. So what have you found to be a challenge here at 8th Street? That's a good question. That's a good question because, you know, every job has a challenge. Every new thing has a challenge. Um, I would have to say, I mean, it's a good challenge, but there are a lot of traditions at 8th Street that have been around for many, many years. I mean, I run into parents and grandparents, like I went to school there and I did that there. So my challenge is to make sure that I don't change a lot of those traditions. Yeah. Um, because they are great traditions and very few schools can say, you know, I've been around for a hundred years and this has been going on. So um, I think that that is a challenge, but it's a good challenge to have. Yeah. So what do you think makes 8th Street soar above all other schools? Well, we definitely do soar above other schools and that's <laughs> always a nice feeling. Um, but I think it really has to do with the families, the community, the support, the staff. We all come together um, and truly are able to help every child. Um, it's nice that even if that student is not in your classroom, um, we know their names, we know a little bit about them, we know about their families, we really can talk to them on a different level. Um, and I think that helps a lot when you can know the true student. Yes. And so that, that helps and we can assist them in any way and we start to see a need, several people kind of jump on it and help them with that need, which is, which is really nice. We really own every student here, not necessarily just as the homeroom teacher for the students. Yes. So. Well, thank you, Mrs. Buck. Yes, well, thank you for coming in. And now back to you, Lydia and Peyton. Today is Good News Club Day, so be sure that you, so be sure that you are in your assigned area at the end of the day. I'll remind our eagles that you need to line up quietly and listen to the instructions from the Good News leaders. Tomorrow will be an early release day. It is also the day for our first nine weeks of work ceremonies. So remind your parents of this important day. Don't forget to bring your lanyards and come dressed with your shirt tucked in, guys. And girls, come looking fabulous. Eagles, don't forget in, don't forget to bring in your candy for kindergarten through second grade and can soda for third through fifth grade. You could win a popcorn and movie party for your class if your class collects the most candy or soda. Sounds like a fun party, so bring in those cans of candy. Don't forget to purchase your fall festival tickets this week. Five for, five for a dollar. The price goes up at the gate. So, purchase your tickets by Friday. It's going to be a great time. See you there. The Eagle Car Roll Friday th for 3rd through 5th grade. Get all of your Eagle Bucks together. Well, that is it for today.